What's the deal? Welcome back to the channel, man. I ain't gonna even front. It's been a long weekend. But not only that, if I'm not really in the mood, I'm not gonna hop on YouTube. I'm not gonna do no reaction videos. I'm not gonna vlog. You know, like, though sometimes when I don't be in the mood and I get started, I get in the mood, but for the most part, I'm not. I'm not gonna half ass nothing. You know, and I'm not gonna force myself to do it if I don't feel like doing it. You know, I'm not gonna treat YouTube like it's a job. You know, I'm supposed to have fun doing this. I'm supposed to feel good doing it. So that's what I'm gonna do. But um, enough of that. If you're new, make sure you subscribe, like, comment, hit that notification bell for show. Sure. We finna get into some uh, young boy. Never broke again. NBA young boy, Kentrell, YB, whatever y'all call him. Uh, yeah, that's what we on right now. The last one did numbers, still going up. I appreciate the love, the support. Keep watching, keep liking, commenting, keep engaging, and uh, you know, I'm gonna keep bringing y'all content. You know, motivate me, inspire me to bring y'all these videos. So this young boy, all in. Rich Porter. I say how I feel. You should really listen. Right it was all mine. All Messed up how people always make me seem like a bad person. I'm just me. Diamonds Suicide. Um, like we all go through it. I don't care who you are. At one point in time, you felt like that. You felt like, man, this is. I'm done with this. I can't take no more. You know, but you always got to look around you. What, what, what got you where you at? Your faith in God, your kids, your family, your mom, your whoever. Always revisit those things, those things that keep you motivated and that keep you pushing. Always, you know, like, that's never the way to go. To take your own life. You already got people out here trying to take you out. You know, we got the government trying to take us out. People in our neighborhood. White supremacists. Like, we, you can't be your own enemy too. Come on now. You know what I mean? But, like, if you ever feel that way, seek help, man. Or, like, pray or, like, try to find yourself in. Man, that. Don't do that. We all know I'm still in. Question my girl, but love her strong. We all know how to do. Pay for my daddy to come up. Question my girl, but love her strong. You know, y'all being in relationships, but we being in relationships. Like, we all, all got insecurities. You know, we all, you know. Got trust issues, but that don't mean we we can't love. Just because we don't trust something a hundred percent, which nothing in life is a hundred percent, don't mean you can't love that person. Don't mean you can't treat them right. You know, don't mean you gotta judge them. Don't mean you gotta always assume they're doing wrong, man. Just love like you never loved before, as they say. Though I need to take my own advice, but do as I say, not as I do. Pray he get up pills. Hope he come take me away. Get me from all for these pills. And come get me from all for this drink before my kidneys say fail. Tell my son and make me calm. I don't know what I'm doing. Tell my girl these hoes can't make me calm. I only want her to do it. Ten lines straight going on ten days. My body ain't got no fluid. Please, oh, please don't die trying. On the road. Oh, all the long stops and the shot ties are unjudgmental. Ain't too far away by the M up where they left my name. Won't be there long. Them bullets left out the way. I say I feel. 
a little to go back a little bit when he said uh you know whatever come take these pills away you know i hope i can stop drinking so it won't mess up my whatever we'd be doing stuff we know ain't right for us but we let life get us down to where we feel like we got to be numb it's hard for us to face the truth reality all we've been through is hard for us to accept those things you know so man how can i numb this a lot of people go to sex a lot of people go to drugs alcohol um whatever like your vice is if it's killing you it's slowing down your your lifespan your life expectancy if it's bringing that down replace that habit with another habit it's hard to get rid of habits you have to learn how to replace bad habits with good habits you know like and obviously the music ain't enough for him him rapping and venting and shooting these music videos it ain't enough that's not therapeutic enough for him to put down the drink or to put down the weed or the pills or whatever else you know so we have to learn how to replace habits instead of thinking damn how i'm gonna stop smoking weed how i'm gonna stop popping pills think about okay instead of smoking weed what else makes me feel good what else relaxes me and calms me down it might be swimming basketball it might be video games something you know what I mean? Like that's how you that's how I think you go about it. These just my opinions. I'm not no doctor, no shrink, no psychiatrist, no therapist, none of that, but that's just how I see it. You should really listen. You was all mine. I be all in. If I took the clean route, my accounts got cleaned out. We'll still be a wall ride with the mops trying to wipe the block down. The rounds on the bottom of that glass, standing in front of mom's house. Steady screaming, gang life. You know how my time coming around. If I say I feel, you should really listen. Hold on. I say I'm hurting. I'm sorry if I hurt you. It's a famous quote. Hurt people, hurt people. So if you ever meet somebody like, and they seem like a good person, but they putting you through, through hell, they damage. They damage goods. That don't mean they're a bad person. They just been through some stuff. They haven't healed. I haven't felt no closure for whatever. They could have lost a loved one. They could have been mistreated. They haven't been healed. So hurt people do what? They hurt people. That's what that means. YB saying he hurt. I'm hurt, so sorry if I hurt you. That's all we know. And when we're mad, we go exhibit anger. When we hurt, we go tend to we tend to hurt other people. And you gotta know yourself, you gotta know how you feel, what you're going through and hit and heal. Find some type of closure. And you know, shit, get back on your, your your ten toes, man, and get better. I say I feel you should really listen. If you was all mine, I'd be all in. If I say I feel you should really listen. If you was all mine. That's that man, uh, mess with the song, the video. Again, I, I don't know if he's changing up what he's rapping about, or I'm just listening closer now. But, yeah, he talked about a few guns and all that, but it, that wasn't the whole, you know how he could get. You feel me? Bang, bang, shoot him up. But, man, I mess with it, man. That seemed like a more, a more thought out and personal song. Seem like he's getting more comfortable really, really expressing his himself. And like I know he he do it throughout all his music, but I don't know. Tell me if I'm wrong. If I'm right, if y'all catch the vibe I'm feeling with this new music he's coming out with. But uh yeah man, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe if you're new, man, and I'm gonna uh get back at it and bring y'all another video, man. So catch the next one. Go catch the last one. And uh see y'all in a minute.